this is a tale of horror and wonder, of innocence and beauty, violence and sin. This story would haunt the island for years to come. It forever changed a fact that young girls were the ones we were supposed to protect. Not be protected from. I want you to take me under the bridge. Ladies, good morning. Good morning. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank you for joining me to talk about Under the Bridge. Uh, so far, I'm only a couple episodes in, but incredible true crime drama. So congratulations. Thank you. And uh, Vertika, you know, Rena has been missing, the character of Rena has been missing for three days. She was last seen going to a party with friends. And this is based on true events, her, her disappearance. Uh, how did you come to understand her playing her, someone who actually existed? Yeah, I think it was really important for me to, you know, see her experiences and honestly relive it as myself. I think the things she went through are just so horrible. And, you know, I think we all experience our own bullying in different ways. So really just kind of playing into that was super important for me. And Ayana, what is Dusty's relationship with Rena? Was it close at one time? Yeah, I think that Rena is, I think Dusty's closest friend. Um, possibly the closest friend that she's ever had. And I think that her journey on in this narrative is deciding whether or not she's going to stick with her head or her heart with the people that she belongs with or the person that she belongs with or the person that she thinks is going to keep her safe. And Brajika, there was many reasons about, about Rena's disappearance, but she was a victim of bullying, wasn't she? And a yeah. uh, group of girls, they all had like a, a gang mentality against her, didn't they? Yes, I totally agree with that. I think... You know, she really wanted to have those friends to call her own. And I think there was a lot of factors that kind of led to her disappearance, but there was definitely an aspect for with her friends for sure. And I have this special group of, of girls that are that are under investigation for Rena's disappearance. Cops call them big girls. How come they call them big girls? They call them big girls because they are comparing them to the lighters, big lighters, which are disposable. Uh, Dusty, my character, and um, some of the other characters live in a foster home. And so the police kind of see them as troublemakers and as not worth their time. It's terrible <laughs> to be called something like that. Uh, and Vertiga, what happens under the bridge? It's symbolic, but is that where bad things happen, good things happen? What's the symbolism of that title? Yeah, I think under the bridge is a super important title. I think it really brings the whole story together. You know, there's a lot of things that happen, a lot of relationships break, a lot of, you know, actions happen. And I think as you watch, you understand and you truly understand what happens. And Ayanna, tell me about shooting. Was it in Vancouver? Because the location, it looks like a character itself. It's so beautiful up there. And it's hard to understand that something so tragic could happen in such a beautiful setting. Yeah. I think that's that's related maybe to um, Rebecca's writing. Her writing has a very fairy tale like quality, and in fairy tales, the environment and the location often seems to be a character in and of itself. Vancouver is such a beautiful city, and I was very grateful to film there. Still can't get over the fact that I would see mountains at the end of the road. It's just a beautiful place. Um, I think that the contrast between the beauty of uh, where we were filming and the violence that we explore in the narrative is just true to life. Absolutely. And Virginia, was Rebecca's book a good resource for you too, for the character? Yeah, I think it was definitely really nice to understand Rebecca's viewpoint on Rena and kind of the things that surrounded Rena, her personality, and the girls as well. Absolutely. Well, ladies, congratulations on a wonderful series. I appreciate thank your you. time this morning, and let's talk again soon. Thank you so much. Yes, thank, thank you. you so much. Have a nice day.